What, What is up, everyone? Welcome to Candle Play. Hello, good hearts and God sense. It's Simon once again, and welcome to our channel Canva Play. Here, we will share Canva design tutorials, tips, tricks, and hacks that will elevate your Canva skills for free. For those who are new to this channel, you can subscribe to our channel if you find it helpful and get updated on the latest posts we share here from time to time by turning on your notifications. Today, we will show you how to make plastic foil wrap effect. Plastic wrap, also known as cling film, is a thin plastic film commonly used for sealing and securing food items in containers to keep fresh. Can we use this in a design? The answer is yes. Can we do it in Canva? The answer again is yes. Do you want to learn this? I know, I know your answer is yes. So let's not make it longer, but first, let me show you the sample that we will create. Let's now go to the blank Canva design editor. Drag a photo from photos or uploads. I will get mine from photos. And this is the keyword of the photo that I'm going to use. I'll type in funny man. Now, um, I'll just pick a photo that I like, this one. For those who are asking if I am using a pro account, yes, I am using a pro version of Canva. But worry not because if you want to have a Canva pro account, I have the link in the description below that will give you access to 30 trial days of Canva Pro. It's completely free and you can cancel it at any time you want, hassle-free. Now, let's proceed. Using this image, set the image as background. After setting it as a background, I'll just reposition it. Perfect, here, and I will now create the effect. Go to Photos, and let's search for shiny, structured, plastic foil. There are lots of stock photos in this keyword, and as you can see, they are multicolored and lots of options to choose from. I prefer to choose the green foil, this one, the first. The keyword for this is transparent structured plastic foil. I will now change the settings of this photo to make it clear and look like a clean film wrap. Using this image, go to edit image. Find color mix. See all. Under it, I'll choose Parakit. Now, let's change the settings. Let's change U to 1. Saturation, negative 1. Then, let's click Apply. After that, change the transparency to 45. This. The green plastic foil became a transparent, clear foil this time after the settings has been applied. Let's use this one as an overlay and cover the whole page. This is one of the easiest way to create the design, merely using a very creative kind of an overlay. Before I end this, I want to show you more options in doing the design. Let's make a duplicate page. I will show you how. Let's unlock this. By using the same uh, cling film that we have used, let's go to Edit Image, find Adjust Settings, See All, and now we can change its looks. If you want it, to look warmer, search for warmth, increase the warmth, 
settings to add yellow or orange tint to your image, like this one. And if you want it to make cooler, to make it cooler, you can decrease it to add a blue tint and pull down the look of your image, like this one. You can also adjust the highlights adjust settings. If you want to make your foil shinier as if a light strikes on it, you can increase the highlight settings like this. And if you want to make your foil a little darker, you can decrease the highlight settings like this one. We can also use clarity settings. If you want to make the foil clearer and very evident, you can increase the settings like this one. Now, let me click the reset button. And I will apply the settings that I prefer for this design. I will now change the settings to Clarity 20, Highlights 100, and look. Look now the image. Okay. I will position again, just checking it if the whole overlay covers the whole page like this one let's now compare the designs i made a while ago with this one to show you the difference created by the adjust settings from this to this from this to this again i'll repeat from this to this that's it For more design inspirations, watch this. If you like this video, don't forget to give us a thumbs up and to be updated with our upcoming videos, click subscribe. Drop your comments below for the tutorial you want to learn next time. Before I end this video, I hope I inspire your creativity. I'm Simon, your good heart BA, saying, sharing is caring. In behalf of Pinky, Gods, and BA, thank you for watching this till the end. Don't forget to hit that little bell icon so you don't miss the next video from Pinky with another exciting Canva tutorial. Bye guys, see you in the next video.